Buonasera, everybody. Wax Upsic here, Wine and Spirits Pro, founder of Wine Living, chilling with my beautiful wife in Venice, Italy, of all places. Now, I want to continue with this uh, video series that I've been doing about the best red wines, and uh, I figured this would be the best opportunity for me to shoot since I'm going to be on the road for a while. I'm currently enjoying a glass of red wine from the northern part of Italy. This is a Valpolicella. You may not have heard of that wine before. It's uh, not very well known in the United States, but uh, Northern Italy makes a ton of this stuff and it's delicious. I would put it on par with maybe a uh, Chianti, maybe that weight, that feel. Um, usually a little bit bitter, a little bit of uh, like a sour cherry kind of flavor going on in there. Uh, there's also another level above this called the Amarone della Valpolicella. The Amarone is actually derivative of the Italian word Amaro. Uh, it's the word for bitter. And it's usually a little bit more bitter because they dry the grapes out on straw mats before they crush them to make the wine. So look out for Valpolicella, which is just the regular level wine, and Amarone della Valpolicella, uh, which is one notch above. That's about it for right now. If you haven't seen the uh, rest of the videos in this series, please check them out. It's called The Best Red Wines, and uh, I promise I'll get back to you once I get off the road. Until then, take care of yourselves and uh, ciao.